Guy still here? Yeah, he's Okay. So what's he doing? My boss is up here. Okay. Is he someone that's not supposed to be here? Or? Well, it's a tenant. He didn't get, unfortunately, evicted yesterday. It's like a tenant, like if nobody lives here, right? No, no, no. no. Yeah, he's, he's like, like a, a client. So. Client, right. But um, his stuff is still here, so he was supposed to get an escort from the police today. But okay. We'll figure it out. Good, how are you, man? Good. Well, it's all right. It's been a long week. <laughs> yeah? yeah. Well, it's Friday for you, right? Yeah, we're going to double. I've been here since five. It's overtime for you? Yeah, yeah. That's good. Yeah. How is SSC? It's not bad. It's not really, you know. Are they still, who's the, uh, like, the regional manager that comes here from the company? Oh, that guy's Peter still around? Yeah, Peter. I used to, I did Actually, that job, like, ten years ago. Right here. Is this him right here? Okay. Yeah. Hey, how are you? Awesome, how are you? Good. How's it going? I don't. Listen, so. <clears throat> sir? I was. I was what, you're an officer? Yeah. Do you have a name, sir? All right, give me one second. Let me talk to. I called the police, sir. Please don't let him leave. I called the police. Get on the elevator okay. without being so, escorted. Yeah, we're going to be right here. I just want to figure out what's going on. That's all. Yeah. So, what's going on? So, this gentleman is a tenant of ours. We lease this whole floor space and rent out the space to different companies. Right, tenant, not like a living, like not. No, 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 right. no, just for an office use. Okay? Gotcha, gotcha. Sorry, and no, sure. um, he is in breach of his contract, and we terminated his agreement this week. Okay. And um, now, after additional behaviors by him and our. So has he been meeting, served anything? Yes, he has. He's been served an eviction, told to go. It's a termination letter and asked to go. Yes. Yeah. When was he served that? Today? That was served on Wednesday. So he's been told. He he's not supposed to be here and correct. he keeps showing that up. Okay, we'll take care of it. You. What's your first name, man? I'm not your man. Okay, what's your first name? What is your first name? We're not going to play this game. We're not going to play a game. You've, I've been told that you've been served an eviction letter. It's time to go. I've not been served. You're trespassing. I'm not. I was asked by the manager. To go with this guy to get my computer. So do you want to get arrested? I would love for you to arrest me, sir. Because you understand that, that that's what could happen here? Well, do you understand, sir, that I know the law better than you? And right okay. now, what you should be doing so is what? the manual says you separate the parties. Yeah. You get one side there. Yeah. You get one side here, correct? Right. So why don't you ask me what's going on? Because I called the police. I called the police. You're, I called the police. Go ahead, so, quickly, like, tell me tell me your side. Okay. I called the police because I've been harassed by this gentleman. We're in a meeting downstairs. I asked him to leave. Where I, you served a letter on Wednesday saying no, you're no sir. longer allowed in the building. No, sir. You're I, saying no. No, sir. So they're lying to me. I don't know what they're saying. They did it. No one has served me a letter. To serve a letter, you call a servant, and he brings okay. it and he says, you've been served. Okay. All right, right. Do me a favor. Just relax right now. We're going to figure this out. You want to post up against there? Post up against there. Sir, you've already talked to them. One now one. it's time to talk to me. Just turn yours down a little bit. Ma'am, can you uh, start us another unit over here? No rush. But we're on the 19th floor. So for what reason the, uh, are we building. getting another unit, sir? Because he's an officer in training. So since he's an officer in training, let's train him properly. No, 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 no. So here's how it goes, Officer 143. What happens when you show up to the unit, sir? you, please, sir. do not approach me, sir. I don't feel comfortable with you. Please not Mr. approach me. I don't feel comfortable. Could you step back? Please, sir. Mr. Cole, I'm asking you to step back. I'll stand over here behind you. It's the uh, 19th floor. Just call, uh, take the elevator to the 19th floor. You'll see us once you get off. Yeah, we're at the Regis building. Yeah, but Does their paperwork, 
for this that he was whatever he it's, was given. It's been put on the assessment. It's been emailed to both. Okay, I need to see that. Yeah, yeah. I need to see that. Thank you. That'll make my job much easier. Thank you. So, sir, if somebody is served, you get you hire someone, get a service, and you deliver it, and then have, I have to sign it. That means it's served. Go in the office where they said that this document is served, and you'll see it. Look for it. So you're saying you didn't serve me? I'm telling you that I was not served. I'm 52, and I have many lawyers to go to. Now, while you are here, is because, officer, we had a meeting brokered by the building manager earlier. Okay. He asked them to come down. The gentleman came, is sitting in there now. It's funny now, he's done, he's gone now. All I want to do is get my computer. They refused to let Bobby come get it. They refused to deliver it to him. So, I'm not cutting you off, but you're saying you still have personal property inside? I have my property. Okay, we'll it's figure that out. Legal lockout. Okay. Relax. We're gonna. Fi we're trying to figure it out. Man. That's why I'm asking for the paperwork and everything else. All right. You should be asking me because I called the police, sir. So this was sent to both email addresses we have on file. Yeah. January 27th, notice of redetermination, and then the. So that's him. He's Sean Marshall. I'm Sean Marshall, sir. And this is the letter. I asked for where my computer is. Thank you. Sir, the computer is there. Just so you know, I'm happy to give him all of his personal belongings. As long as he goes. As long as he leaves. Okay. So, how about we do that? Because I'm, what I'm reading here is you, you're not supposed to be here. And what I'm telling you. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'll tell you, I'll hold show, on. I'll show from their corporate office. Why okay. I'm We're going to get you your stuff. I'm going to make sure she goes and gets it for you. Then it's time to go after that. He has a lot of personal belongings here. They have illegally locked me out of the office that I have a valid contract until the end of February, which they told me she was on the phone. And then since then, they told me that your contract is being terminated immediately. Did you serve me? Do you know what? Are yes. You a lawyer? And we sent it to. The other email address the, that you requested the is yesterday. locked up in the office. Now, are you who's like the manager of the? Uh, so, the so the, the only one I'm the area vice president for th this, this region. Company. Right. Over You're this center. Right. Yes. So by you and you by you saying to him verbally, you need to leave. You're not supposed to be here. Yes. That's enough. Right. Okay. I just wanted to make sure. I, just, I don't know who's in charge or not. They all report to me. We're all perfect here. Let me give you your phone back. Okay. So that's a good one. And then when you finish with that, I'll show you the email from their vice president that says that I'm supposed to be here. This is a great this is a third, because you're going to see great 30 day notice. Was he giving something on September 22nd? No, that was his agreement that entered with gotcha. us in the beginning. Okay. When, when this officer was are you going to be at Mr. Marshall? Are you going to be able to get all your stuff out? No, sir. My, my the only thing I'm coming to get is my computer. Okay. Then why don't what we're going to do is because she's agreeing to it. We'll go get your computer. Then it's time to go. As far as hold on, let me explain everything here. Okay. As far as the rest of your property goes, you'll have to arrange another point in time to take care of that. So who's going With to them. take the police report? They told me you would take both police reports when I called. Both? What are you for? I'm not sure what you're referring there to. There are two police reports that I told the dispatcher. Okay. Should have been informed. We're going to figure that out. I'm just telling you for right now. You want your computer? She's allowing that. We'll go from the there. It's time to go. The only person that is touching my computer is me or Bobby. Okay. I'm not being escorted anywhere with anybody because I didn't do anything illegal. As a matter of fact, the person, the optimal person that you should be talking to is me, because the next call I make is the chief residence. Okay, that's fine. And so what I'm saying is, you've now heard their side. Yeah. Now protocol says you come here my side, and you separate the parties. I don't feel comfortable. Mr. Marshall. Mr. Marshall. Mr. Marshall. Here. You're confusing things. No, no, I'm very clear. You're supposed to separate the parties. Don't please don't start trying to tell me how to, I'm supposed to do this, okay? I'm trying to give them I'm trying a to, good education. We're trying to be as civil about this as we can. Good They're good. willing to work with you. Good Go time. get your computer. Sir, what I said is I will go with the secretary, the office manager, Donna, 
to get my computer. Okay. I will not be followed by her or this master. We will do me. that. I just need you to calm down, man. You're, you're rambling. Just no, relax. I'm not rambling. This is two days of this crap. Okay. I spent four thousand dollars and two days setting up my materials okay. in an office that is a common area, which I'm allowed to use. Okay. And Donna said you can only use it for two hours. I said, then ma'am, just bill me. My photographer will be back. So now I'm out of hundred and fifty thousand dollars because the four thousand dollars of free clothing, food, excuse me, sanitary stuff that I was going to give right. to the homeless is not here. And it's not on that document. So the question he should be doing is, what is my side? That's what I'm trying to educate the young man on. Because that document is just a document they printed out. Does it show where I've been served? Is there, you, you know how this works, officer. I do. Server, you have to hire someone to serve it. I know that. And who was hired to serve? Listen, man, I don't want any, I just want this, I want you to be able to get your things and for you to go on your way. Well. That's all. Sir, I've asked to get my computer. Be able to get my computer. Okay. I asked Bobby to get it. So this is what we're going to do. When the other officer gets here, okay, we're going to figure that out for you. I don't need. It. I'm going to go downstairs by myself in an elevator by myself, okay. and I'm going to sit. And someone from Reapers or Bobby is going to bring it down. That's how we're going to do it. And this gentleman has been harassing me, not allowing me, not allowing me to get it in the elevator. That is illegal. Well, you can't. Don't go up on the elevator yet. Okay. Sir, I can do what I want. Do you want to leave? I want to sit downstairs because I'm tired of this. Where's your computer? You want to get your computer. I'm confused. You said you want to get your computer. If you want to leave, you can leave. I'm, I'm going to let you walk away. I'm saying. You're not in any trouble with me right now. But if you want your computer, now is the time. We're not going to. We're not here. We can't be here all night going up and up and downstairs with you. Sir. Okay. I don't need to stand here. Either you guys sit down and let me go get my computer. Or I go down and then bring it down. That's it. Simple. Do you understand that he's going to have to go with you? No, I don't. Or that one of us is going to have to go with you? Bobby, would you like to ride in the elevator with me, sir? Yeah. Okay. Once you go downstairs, we're not playing this up and down game, though. Do you understand what I'm saying? So sir, do you want your computer or not? Here's what we we'll, we'll do it. I'm going to give him a good case. Let's turn Because the more I read this, I, I, I like... It's a civil matter. Exactly. So you have no jurisdiction. Hold on. Right. Hold on. Tell, explain Hold. to him. Hold on. Explain to him, sir. Stop. Dude. Try what to do. My name is Mr. Marshall. If okay. you want to express yourself to me, you say Mr. Marshall. Is that clear? Mr. Marshall, yes, sir. You're not in control here. I'm going to actually, warn you of that one last actually, time. Actually, I am in control. No, you're not. I'm going to warn you of that one last time. Sir, you don't We're working with you. You're not working with yes, me. Yes, I am. Sir, if you're working with me, you ask me for my documentation. Your not documentation. You. I did ask you that over there. You didn't want no, to tell you me your did name. No, not. So now you're lying to me. No, sir, I'm not lying. I asked you over there what your name was. You didn't want to tell me what your name was. I didn't tell you my name because I don't need to So what are we doing? Are we grabbing your laptop or are we going downstairs? What we're doing is we're following police protocol. You separate the parties. Interview them. Now, You're confusing that with a domestic violence situation. No, we've already done this yesterday with the police. Come on, in, man. If you need to come on to the floor, you need to come on to the floor. Come on. Oh. So, what do you want to do here? I'm ask. We're going to ask. Like, we can't. You're. Everybody's standing here. We're standing here. They're standing here. You're standing here. I don't want you to waste your time. What I'd like to do. You want to get your computer, right? Which is located here on this floor. Yeah. I'm just recording, so we're all clear. Okay. So here's what I'd like to do. Because that has no jurisdiction and was not served to me. If you'd like to see, where did where was this served? Where on your end do you have any of this? I don't have this. So you don't you weren't you haven't seen this until no, today. No, sir. Okay. Because my computer is locked. All right. All right. You don't get it on your phone or anything. I have not checked. My computer is locked. Okay. And the other computer is at the hotel where I had to right. not be at because I'm here. So let me explain something to them because the furthermore I read this. Um, all right. Give me one second. Just you need to stop. Like, just stop interrupting me, please. I'm trying to work with you. I'm not interrupting. All right. Just relax. Can I just talk to you guys for a second? Because there's a few issues with this. I don't think I can enforce this. This is a 30-day notice, and he's been. You know what I'm saying? That's January 25th. I don't think 
No, she. I think she printed, she printed the wrong one. one. I was going to say that I can't. I can't yeah. enforce sorry, that. that was yeah. The first one. yeah. Um, okay, that I can't enforce. So, like, technically, sorry. I can't. Because I'm reading it, I'm like, I'm reading it, I'm like, I don't think I could enforce that. Yeah. yeah. That I can't. I can't do nothing with that. You know what I mean? I'd be violating his rights. Um, okay. And they were. It was served. Now, was it actually? Yeah, that's what I need. It says, and and the letter served in. It says. Via hand delivery, which is in his office. That's which if he I could look. If I him. could look at that, that's that's exactly yeah. what I need. Yeah. Then I could say he's trespassing. Service elevator, wherever that is. <clears throat> yeah, that would be beautiful. That I could actually enforce. I can't enforce that thing. That that's I don't know what. Okay. Um, <laughs> Probably signal to us following each other on Grand Avenue. They just blew the light at uh, Grand and East, going westbound. Doing about 45 miles an hour. Signal left on the animal. Covering five. Yeah, they're following each other again. And they're, they're uh, both coming on the highway right now. Yeah, we are too. <laughs> we people don't realize that we're always rolling too. Um, it's just yeah, obviously, like I said if it shows that he was served this civil or not, if it shows that he was served that he's no longer allowed in the building, then he's trespassing. Yeah, email and hand delivery. And okay. yesterday he verbally asked us to send it to an email address, which is was his attorney, yep. which we re-forwarded it to. And then today, when we tried to meet with him civilly earlier. I asked him to confirm the email, and he wouldn't give it to me, and Rob is a witness to that. Okay. Okay, here's this one. You got it, Donna? Yeah. Okay. This is just from like a month of stress, officer. Uh, I could see. Yeah, he's he's looking for. I think he wants something to happen here, and I don't. What does he? What does? What does he do for a living? What does he? It's consulting. He does consult. Is he an attorney? No. Are you guys attorneys? No. No. Well, I'm, okay, I didn't know what no, what you guys. No, no. we have okay. all different companies that we gotcha, that gotcha. we lease the space to, and yep. it's also not a, a real estate lease; it's a service agreement. Right. Right. Yes, it's not like real estate. It's yeah, not. No. This isn't. We're not. That's what I want to be clear about too. We're not. We're not talking. Because that's a totally different ball game when you're going to evict a tenant, yes. an actual tenant out. And our attorney, out of right. our corporate office, um, verified with a. Connecticut attorney that we have right to serve him this yesterday. For so he was served this yesterday. He was served this on Wednesday, and then it was resent. Put on his desk. And, and then resent to him. Yeah. Um, again, copied oh, him as well as to the email address that he. Okay. Told so what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to hand this to him now. You guys hang in here. Okay. Mr. Marshall. Okay. Hold on. Okay. okay. I get that, but I need you to look at this. I don't. You don't need to look at anything, sir. That goes to my attorney. Yesterday, they were given the emails, any official document, to go to my attorney. This sir, is, I don't need to look at. It anything. says right here, you must vacate the center and office immediately. This was sent two days ago. And it did not get to me. You're being told now. Look, look at the office where it is. Go You're to being go. told now. You're not being told me. I'm, I'm here. So it's time to go. No. Do you want to get your computer? Okay. Unless you guys can. Sir, would you, I'm trying to express my He did get it. Story. He was just saying he did. I did not. I understand that, Mr. Marshall. Go to the office, 1978. Bobby, take him to the office and you see where the document is. Go see. Or you want to see the picture? This is the office. It, this isn't, it's not real estate. You know what I mean? It's not. Uh, it's not like it's a landlord tenant issue. It is. Stuff. I mean, it. It is. It is. He's, is Mr. Marshall appears to be absolutely correct in that this is a civil matter, and so yeah. he, if he needs to get into the office, yeah. he's going to need to contact his lawyer and sue civilly in order to get into the office. Right. You're correct. Well, here's the thing. This is not a police matter. We can't breach the office for you. And I'm not asking you to. I sat downstairs and asked if Bobby can go get the computer. They refused. Then the office manager said, "I know." I know, but remember before, remember a few minutes ago we were talking, I said, 
But you don't let we we want you we want you to get your computer, you but we can't sit here and argue all day either. But, but, but I'm telling you though, off of what this is, okay? Sir, this is a place of business. This is a private business. They have informed you that you're not supposed to be here anymore. No, as of two days get ago. Get the contract. They didn't inform me anything. I'm not served. That then turns it criminal. You're not supposed to be here. You've been told. You've been told. This this is where it turns criminal. Okay. You've been given that. Actually, you're here. At my request, you're not here at theirs. It doesn't turn criminal. It turns criminal on the two harassment cases that we're going to do once we go downstairs. Sure, All I will same. gladly talk to you about that. But I'm telling you right now is we can't. There's there's no more argument. Okay. So would you like Bobby to go get your computer? I've said that. I'd like to go downstairs and go down by myself. I don't need to be escorted by police or this gentleman. Okay. We're all going to go downstairs together, you're but not, for right I'm now... I'm getting in the elevator with anybody. Okay, you're I'm not, Mr. Marshall, you're not understanding. I'm, I'm being as patient with you as, as I possibly has can. Been preventing me from getting in the elevator. Okay. And that is illegal. That's, that is illegal. Sir, you need to just calm down and relax. Sir, what we're telling you is what we can do and what we can't do for you. After a month of harassment. Okay. Yesterday... I don't... You could... I want you to tell me about that, but for right now, we got to... Can we... Figure out what is Bobby going to get your laptop now? I'm going downstairs to sit, and then he yeah. can go. Yeah, no, I accept. Bob, I, I'm not being make this decision. So You're not supposed to be here anymore. We're being very, we're, we're being really lenient with you. But here's the problem. You're not. That is not valid. That was not served to anyone. You just so, you're being told about it right now, sir. That was supposed to go to a lawyer. It is no different. Okay, can I explain sir, this to you? No, 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 no. Stop. No, did I read the document? I'm telling you what it says. I don't trust you. I don't know you. So, Would you like to read it? I do not want to read it. Okay. In that case, you're they were informed. If, if that to my listen, lawyer. And one last time. But can you listen to me, sir, for once? Just listen to me. Go ahead. This is. Go ahead. Listen your last chance. Me. Go ahead, please, Mr. Marshall. Go but ahead. The only thing that is valid is a contract. They need to show me the rental contract. That is not valid unless it was served and signed for. What's valid is the rental contract. My rental contract says that I have the right to be here to the end of February. Get the contract. Okay. That's what you need. Okay. Mr. Marshall, the contract you're speaking of is a civil matter. Yep. And my point You were absolutely correct when you said that is a civil matter. Correct? And that is a civil matter. So if you show up to any place of business, any go up to any place of business, you get through the door, it could be somewhere you go all the time. It could be Starbucks. It could be the coffee shop you go to and you give $5 to every day. But that you, you might keep them in business. You go to that coffee shop and they say you are not allowed here anymore Gotta and go. you continue to stay, that is a criminal offense. That's effect. exactly what that's I was just going to say. That's the but problem we're having. Talk, but I'm, but I'm, see, you need to listen to what happened. I've been trying to leave since before you got here. He has been preventing me to go down to the He's just doing his job. Oh, He's security time. just like Bobby is, and okay? I can go down in an elevator and not be a harm to anybody. I don't, well, that's we, I don't think already, that you're going to be a harm. But he's already been lying, so I'm done with him. Okay. Now, so here it is. Here it is. Last chance. I would like to go down in the elevator by myself and let Bobby go get my computer. And I will wait. Bobby can go get it right now. No, he cannot. Oh, he can't. He can't even go in there and get the expertise. We are not going to risk. Oh, that's right. He's your he's your guard. I forgot about yes. that. So okay. He have a so then he can't do it then. That's his job. He can't do it. So, sir, so we I'll can walk you in there and get it, I'll, I'll or you don't get I'll it. I'll go with the officer. We'll go this way. And Let me. Stay. I got to check with them to make sure that's okay. If one of us walk him in to get his computer really quick, is that okay? Someone from our team. It could be Donna. It's fine, but. Okay. Well, we're gonna obviously one of us is gonna come as well. Someone needs to know from our team right. what our that's fine. Is and, and if it's not that way, then that's it. So he's not getting it right. We need someone from our team. Of course. No. 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 Okay. No problem. This is besides the point. It's completely besides the point for us. What we're trying to do is help you retrieve property. Is help you okay. retrieve property. So are we. So what we're trying to do is help you retrieve property that you would like back. That's what we're trying to do. Can you you want it done in a certain manner. However, we are not able to do it in that particular matter that you would like it. So how, we are how, trying to facilitate you getting your property back. Oh, okay. But so if, can we do this? Right. I would like for you to see all of the property. That's fine. So here's how this, I just talked to them. Okay. One They're willing. Hold on. She can escort me. I'm she's fine. gonna. She's gonna. But also one of them has to come with. No, sir. And then that's the, then we're at the end if, of the if, road. If Marcia want, Maria wants to come, she can come. Who's Perfect. Maria? Which one? Okay. Then she's good. So, 
You guys are going to go. It's not, we're not. She knows the drill. She's going to explain this to you. If this is taking too long, she's going to call me. And we're, you know what I mean? 15 minutes total. Okay. So let me get, what is her name? So we're not this man doing anything. 15 minutes okay. total. Yeah. We're taking what we need to get, and we're leaving. Maria? He's asking for you to... Uh... Okay, and actually, could I just request for Donna to come with you? Only because I don't know which office exactly is his, because yeah. I'm not here every day. So come on, let's go, Mr. Marshall. Donna, I'm going with her, right? Yeah, yeah, we're going to wait here. Yeah. Sir, I don't know which office it is. You'll oh. have to leave me. Go ahead. Oh, okay, I want you to get your computer. No, I, I need to show her all the merchandise. So. Okay. She knows the drill, so if she calls What exactly me. are we retrieving? Computer. Before we even go in there, what are we retrieving? Computer. The computer. That's it. That's so well, we need, will I retrieve need, the computer. No, I need to get some other things out of the office. No, sir, it's just your computer. Mr. We're Marshall, not, we're we not will here retrieve to... the computer. I'm... Anything else you can sue civilly for. No, I need to get... And you can take this document, and you can bring it to your no, lawyer, and you can sue civilly. I need to get something out of If we're not on the same page with this, we're, we're going to have a problem. You're not going to be able to get your computer. What we are here to retrieve today is your computer. I will escort you May I have to the my office. Suits so I can go to work. I have six suits. Whatever you no. could physically grab in five minutes, that's it. Are you down to five minutes now? Sir. She said fifteen. Well, so fifteen. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, just we're gonna be right here. They're his suit. I mean, are they his suits? So did the did, did they pay for office. them? They're your suits. Suits in, that you paid for. In my for. office. Okay. Did he pay did you did pay for anything the suits? Anything in his office. He so they're his belongings, so we'll sure. retrieve his belongings. Aside they're from going to be able to carry it all right no. now. No. That's whatever he can carry. Whatever he can take in the next fifteen. And then we're gonna go. We're gonna wait right here. Yep, we're gonna wait right here. Ashley, just call me, obviously. Just you guys. We're waiting here. So you understand why this turns criminal now, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is not working. Yeah. This is not working. We're trying to be lenient with him, you know. That's how he's got five minutes. Yep. Yeah. Did somebody, sir? Is anybody, like, why was he banned from here anyways? Do you know? From what I understand is he had an office. Yeah. He talked to somebody to open up another office. Right. And stuff and today, then this conference room here, which you can sign up for for two hours each. Right. He put a bunch of stuff in there. So he's violating the rules. And that's, and that's why, why they're they asking him to do it. Right. He just came and, in and, and just took over the place. And yeah. he, he's been constantly Sorry. changing... The, the conditions. I was downstairs, right. and he said, let's go up, get your computer. Okay, fine. Let's go up. We come up. I was going with him. He didn't want Maria and Sean no, to follow. I don't know. Is he, does he and have anything else going on, like drinking or uh, He seems a little cooler, to yeah. be honest. And okay. I explained to him, I said, if you have something in your house, right. and somebody came to pick it up, you would have the right to follow him to pick it up. Maria right. Well, Sean that's what I'm trying to explain. So we do that's calls. But he didn't want to go down there and get it. If they were following him. Right. And what he doesn't understand is we don't, we're not a moving company. Right. You're not, I'm not. Now, we, what we'll do quickly is, you know, let's say, yes. yeah, whatever you want to do. Well, we, like, what we do for, let's say, a couple that was in a domestic situation, right? And now there's like a protective order or something like that. And they call, hey, man, like, well, my shit's inside her place. What we do is, right, we got like 10, 15 minutes, go grab the essentials, medicine certain clothes, whatever you need. But we're not here. If you want to freaking hire us to move you out, you gotta you gotta hire us on extra duty to do that. Right. He's throwing out the thing. He's recording everything. He wants. He keeps changing. I said we are too. Yeah. So that we will mess we're up and say something to. inappropriate. You know? That's what he's he wants yeah. you to do that. He exactly. wants me to do that. He and wants I said, he wants you to do I'm that. Fine. That's why we're being very like patient. Okay. And I and he wants to walk behind me and I'm not comfortable with Absolutely. That. No man we're not gonna we're not we don't want you to be yeah. putting any this is like I was just explaining to them, you know, we're trying, because anybody could see what, what he's, the game he's trying to play. Yeah. He wants me to make a mistake, you guys to make a mistake, him to make a mistake, mm -hmm. so that he could sure. sue everybody. Sure. You know what I mean? Sure. That's what he's hoping for. 
that's why when that first one you print out, I'm like, oh, man, I can't really. Yeah, right, <laughs> it said right. 30 days. She and then that second one, that the second one, I'm like, no, it says right here. It's no different than like we said to him. If you're at Starbucks down the street and you're causing a problem in there, Starbucks that says that? to you, hey, you need to go. Yeah. It's a private business like this is. And when you say no, they call us. The first thing we ask is, did you ask them to leave? And they say, yes, this is the same thing. This isn't considered like, you know, it's, it's not, he doesn't live in the apartment building over there, right. And you know what I mean? And you hand me this and it's not properly, it's not, you know, then that's different. It's a service agreement. Yes, exactly. It's a service agreement. Exactly. So that's what we're trying to explain to him. That this falls in line, same thing with, like I said, you're at Stop and Shop, Starbucks. Uh, the restaurant, whatever, and they ask you to leave, refuse to leave, it's trespassing. That's what I'm trying to explain to him. It's so, like, yeah. And we'll do this. We'll give you a little leeway. But she's, he's got five minutes. If she calls me on the radio. She said he's arguing with her down there. And he gets arrested. You know what I mean? Not, not only for trespassing, but for interfering with our investigation. And we're going to document everything on our end for you. Once we're done, he leaves. I'm going to, you know, I'll come back upstairs. I'll just get a little bit of information from everybody. Just because we're going to write a report Thank just you. to make sure to help, you know. Thank and you. also, now there's a police report, him saying he's no longer supposed to be here. So, God forbid, he shows up on Monday yeah. pulling was a some crowd. Yesterday as well. yes. What's that? There was a police report yesterday. There was? Yes. Okay. Yeah. The police came yesterday. Was well. he asked to leave yesterday? Yes. And, and when what he, happened? And he, again, he didn't. They brought him down to the lobby. He waited. In All right, I'm going to read. We'll, we'll, yeah. we'll find that in our system when we go back downstairs. And so this is, so I'm just curious when he this was is, coming so up to There was two cops here yesterday I as well. I thought I it was just so, yeah. I, you I was or Rob. So. Okay. Up. I didn't know if he slipped into the elevator with you. No, no. I, I was oh, you were. Right that was your yeah, understanding. Okay. To, okay. Okay. Because originally it was going to come up and then, like I explained, yeah. Yeah. this is your house. You wanted to go with him. Yeah. Oh, I don't want you to come with us. I'll find out. I'll, when we get back to our car, I'll, I'll be able to pull up the exact report because I was off yesterday. We, were, we weren't here, but I'll be able to pull up the report. I'll see exactly what it was told. And that's even more probable cause for us if we have to make an arrest, right. which we're being really lenient because, like I say, he's trying to play a game. However, if all of a sudden he comes back or he's taking too long back there, he's going to get put in handcuffs and then he's going to be dragged out if, yeah. if need be um, if he wants to argue and fight. We're just, this is, this is wasting everybody's time. Right. There, you know, your time. Uh, <laughs> I don't watch the my concern was, what if she has trouble with them? Yes. And yes. Donna didn't have a phone yeah. to call us. So. I can't let you do that. Right. Under my instructions. Right. And I totally forgot. You can't have your guard. Yeah. I totally forgot that he was, he's a security guard. For you guys, you can't have him. You get, you go when you get involved. It now puts a liability on that, on SSC, and you don't, they don't want that. Um. It's just this whole thing is. Yeah, he wants some, want all of us to make a mistake, you know, and that's what he. And he's. It's just. Yeah. 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 So for your four-year report, too. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, it's just what he, you know, and they always people always think, oh, I'm going to call Chief Ray. Listen, I've been doing this job eight years. If they would say they call Chief Esserman, Chief Campbell. It, it, they all say that, and it's, they think it's going to make us be different. You know what I mean? He emailed our chief officer over the weekend, and she is in Amsterdam. Wow. So she, yes. she you know, was different time zone. So before she was able to ask us a question, she responded really quick. Well, I'm so sorry, Mr. Customer. We'll get that taken care of right away for you. So that's what he was referring to. So he's trying to, yeah. yeah just yeah. He's playing a game. And, and, and he's, he's harassing her. her. He's yeah, he's not. No, he's, he's not stupid. Her yeah. Now. He's harassing. He's been harassing our team at all hours in the middle yeah. of the night, texting, calling. Oh my God. He like four four so what does he do? It's. He says some he's kind a of consulting. consulting. I, okay. Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, it's, it's not. It's not even a. Uh, it's not even a lease. It, it, this is just no. a contract. Like, this is an agreement for you. And yeah, for you guys to. And he's been harassing our, our other clients. In right. The we have a documented email from them asking, can you please make him stop? Um, he took a time and a Let me grab that quickly. <clears throat> While we're waiting for them, I'll grab that info I'm going to need from you. Okay. Um, your first name, ma'am? Maria. Last name? I'll spell for you P like Peter, yep. A I, T like Tom, C like Charles, H E L. Your date of birth, Maria? 328, don't tell anyone. <laughs> 63. <laughs> Phone number for here? 
Uh, do you want my phone number? They'll come number for here, okay. or they could reach you here if they need no, to. I don't even know the number here, Sean. Or whatever, whatever you want to give me is fine. It doesn't matter. For my number, you can give me. Yeah. I'll give you myself six three zero. Yep. Seven one zero two nine five eight. All right. I'm just going to use one fifty seven church nineteen four. And you're the vice president, you said, right? Correct for the northeast. Right. Mm -hmm. So not just this office, Correct. but the entire northeast. Gotcha. Very nice. All right. And this has been, when did he first agree to be a um, tenant? His agreement whatever? date was yep. on uh, September 22nd, I believe. Okay. So that's when he started here? No. No. The date of the agreement, um, I, I believe, let's see, dated. Yeah. But that, but that was when the agreement was dated. It probably started November 1st. But so he started working in here like 1st. around November, in around October, October, November? Probably around October. I can and then he gets that other though. notice two days ago mm -hmm. because of his behavior, which you guys have a right, right. to do. So, so what happened is um, he's been harassing the team, he's been harassing clients. They so people that don't have anything to do with them right. in his business right. or whatever. Right. Our team is here to, to service our right. So they are right. here to service them, but he asked for demands that we couldn't do, yep. like access to the gym, which is not open, that he said we have control over, and continued to, right. you know. Just and who's the person that wrote that letter? Is it you? Um, no, our in-house counsel. But it's addressed from me. It's addressed from, from you. In-house counsel writes the letter saying you're banned effective immediately, yes, right? Yes, per our, you know, agreed upon legal team. legal team. Your legal team, yeah. right, so to speak. And then you obviously give it the okay because you're the vice president. Yes. Correct. Okay. I just yeah. it just helps, especially if this does take a turn. I don't think it's anything. He's just going to grab his stuff and go. If God forbid this takes a turn in a minute or two. It's always good to have information. So if we yeah. have to lock them up. It gives. It just makes the probable cause always stronger. Also, what occurred on um, over the weekend was he somehow we still don't know how he got into an office that he does not have a contract for. Okay. So we don't Did know. anything happen in there? He moved all the stuff in there. He just like messed with the stuff. Yeah. I mean, it's not damaged or anything. And that was over the weekend? Yes. Now, how did he get in here? Is we he don't know. Well, he has access to the floor. Right. We don't know how he got into the office. It doesn't belong to him. Okay. And we asked him, and he wouldn't tell us. Yeah, today okay. he had a different story. Today he said Donna unlocked it for him, which is not true. And then on Wednesday, he took over another office that he does not have access to. There. So he's so just he's, he's going around. Yeah, you have every reason to be asked. It's just what he doesn't understand. Yeah, so I don't know if he if somehow he told the cleaning. And what is the technical out. term again? It's not a it's, it's not a even a rent. Agreement. It's a service agreement for him to use the office. Correct. Which also does not have it's, it explicitly says. For no overnight, um, doesn't right. say overnight. No living. For access, no living. Right. No living. Right. And we, he has, we found him in the office sleeping a couple of occasions. I just want to add because I have a feeling he's going to come back again. Yeah, I know. So I just want to really, I don't know how well the officer wrote the report yesterday, but I'm going to write a good one. So if he does come back next week, this is going to be no BS. He's going to get put in handcuffs. Because now that we're here, we told them there's reports written about this. Yeah. Um, you know. And we appreciate that. No, it's just like you're all set. Like, I'm sorry, we're wasting your time. You know, our you know all of our time really. But uh, I it's good to hammer this home now. So if he shows up again, it just makes it so much more criminal. You know what I'm saying? Um. Yes. Yeah, so is there anything else like like this that he should up intoxicated or? Looking like he's high on drugs because his behavior is kind of. So when he when he started with us originally, yeah. the team said that there was no trouble at all, different personality, just very calm and businesslike. Right. And then after the first of the year, something flipped. They don't know what, 
Okay, but so something's going on with something him. Un yeah. Maybe something personal. He's something mm -hmm. unstable. Which is... Yeah, you can see it out here because he's like... Very, very much a professional. Right. Right. Yeah, he's very... You, we right. noticed that too. Like, I'm talking to him, then he's like, don't tell me this. You should be doing... Like, buddy, I... I I, he's saying, you know, you need and to separate from, like, this isn't a domestic violence, like, stop. Like, stop thinking you know what, how this is supposed to go, right. you know. But that's where he's up and down. Yeah. Like, you and can see he's just... And he was referencing a conversation that I was on the phone with, that things that were said of him, which were completely untrue. Right. And we had three people's witness on the call that he's saying are different than right. what really happened. Right. Like I said, an hour, hour and a half ago, he could have come up here and left, but because Ray and Sean were coming down the hall, right. which they have to do, this is there before. Right. You know, yes, no, this is your good. Now all of a sudden it's harassment. Right. I don't want that well, right. I didn't go for And he didn't want right. me all of a sudden. Yeah, yeah. 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 he yeah. asked for you he first. He wanted to walk behind me. Yeah. Like, I'm not yeah, he's, you're the only one he actually asked for. And we're like, all right, who do you want? And he's like, I want to go with her. Where is he right now? He's back there at the computer room. All right. And what does he have in his hands? He took bags of cl uh, clothes over on that side in his original office. Now he's... Where is he in another office? She's very good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She's very good. She's, she's good with him, though? Cause if, all right, because if I walk in there, it might turn him into... Yeah, I won't like you there because I just don't want him going and taking no. things. Where she doesn't know what all the other stuff is yeah, that's what we way. need to. That's why I'm not asking him to take more. Yeah, I want to make sure he's not taking things he's not supposed to. They're ringing the time clock. I know, but we can only do so much for you. I apologize, and I really like you to get your things. Did but, she tell you? Know. you did I know her since she was before she was on the fourth? Oh, yeah. We met once in passing, yes. We met uh, while I was doing my interview. And Very cool. And who coached you? You did. I coached her. Small world. Small world. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, I'm going to get some more no, it's not. It's not. Cleaning people opened it for him and me. No, no problem. I'm Officer McKernan. Ashley McKernan. Mm -hmm. you, absolutely, you are correct. I wouldn't say that. Is he unplugging? Mm -hmm. okay. oh, he's moving. As long as he goes. You're trying to smooth us. Seven one, you're seeing a three four five four. That's three four five four. Sixteen thirty. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-
you know, man, your best friend tells you to run, then you get your wife's permission, then, then you gotta run, right? You gotta do it. And so here's, Life's too short. So here's the thing. Do you think I make a good man? I think so. But here's the thing. You just remember me. Where you gotta be? Well, to be fair, I also sure. saw you. Hi, Mr. Marshall. Oh, man. The last, back when I was doing my interviews, that was pre COVID era. Did you tell her that I, I coached her for her interview? No, she's going to have to tell me about it afterwards, yeah, though. I love the man. I'll have to, she'll tell me about it afterwards. Dude, I'm the guy, Pastor Brown, who I told you should be mayor. She prays for you guys every morning. I Christmas. believe it. And she's done it at the meeting. God bless. So here's the thing. You guys need all the prayers from the Jews, the Muslims. It is so hard to be a cop now. In this environment, mm -hmm. those four cops in the D.C. Mm -hmm. A man into a, a Marine. What is his name? The officer? Yeah. Officer Paul. Paul. I ran into a Marine at the Bate. Okay. And uh, he was like, look, if I... You might be able to... No, no, no. Yeah. He said, if he was... On duty, uh -huh. that day that they stormed the White House, he said it would have been him alone. It would have been over. It would have been a different story. Yeah. And guess what? They should have known that those people were mean to do. But so if you didn't think that blue lives don't matter, now you know. Because those guy officers got waylaid. Right. And, and if you think that there's no white privilege, how many white people do have? Not a one. No, one did. Actually a single one. No, 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 it was a, a woman. She was an Air Force veteran, but she was one of the ones storming the Capitol. She got, she got shot and killed. Because she, she was a. Because she was storming the Capitol. Yeah. Well, check this out. This is great. All right, we're good. Perfect. No, no, I gotta get the clothes. All right, we got to... They're coming on the cart. Yep, just just try and hurry it up, Mr. Marshall. Yeah, in the cart, and we've got a couple bags down the hallway. We're going to throw on the cart, and then I'm we're going to be down. All right, we got to... Can somebody take the cart, then? We're we're gonna help you out, but they gotta close soon, okay? So we gotta we gotta really. And we get downstairs. I want you to tell me everything that on your on the harassment. But right now, I really need you to like within five minutes here, speed this up so that they can close, okay? Like I said, if you need to leave a couple things, leave a couple things and contact a lawyer. Yep. All and right. I know that that's not the route you wanted to go, but unfortunately, that may be the route that you have to take. The lawyer. Which one should I call? I don't know. I actually have one that I think is a very good lawyer. If you'd like, you I can. He's, you... he's working with one of the victims from an evading that I had. He seems to be very good, very knowledgeable. But do you think your lawyer is better than yeah. my fraternity brother's firm? Let's Sorry, get this out of the way. You should call. I got one lined up if you need one. That's all I was saying. Hey, Joe, um, sir. Has this got wheels? Uh, no, he comes from this. Let him get it from the front. Help him with this. Right. We're, we're done, right? This is it, right? Okay, come on, ready? Let's go. Oh, it's stuck on the chair. All right, so. Yeah, we gotta go that way, because I'm not dealing with those people. Okay. We can go out that no, way? No, no, we're going no, this, we gotta go this way. Is this yours? Yes, sir. Don't forget it. Got it. Put that on there. Yeah, just hold up a second. We'll be over there in just a minute. Just wrapping it up. If it avoids. At least we got most of it. Yeah, and if it avoids this, then that's oh. fine. You saw that. We got $5,000 worth of merchandise. I know, but I mean, at least you got you got now, your essentials. Can he you got put your that computer stuff and... on the bottom, this guy? Which this stuff? stuff? You know the stuff? He's got it. Before. He's carrying it. He's got no, it. No, 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 no. No, there's more down the hall. We could try to, I think we could try to stick it on the bottom. Let's do it. Come on. We'll carry a couple things. Let's go. Don't forget your, your uh, jacket and your hat. No, no, my hat is here. Check that one. Put it on there. Would you like me to place these over here? I'm not wearing gloves. Is that okay? I trust you. I got you. Okay. okay. We're going to wheel this bad boy out the, for you. I'll put your jacket right on top. He's got I'll, it right I'll there. Leave this, I'll, leave I'll leave this with you as well. That's just going to be a nuisance. Okay. Yeah. We'll leave that here. All right. There we are. There we go. Let me get this stuff here. Officer, just this. Okay, grab that and let's let's hit it. All right, then you could carry it out. I'll get your other things for you. Just put this on the bottom. Oh, he's got it already. He's just right here, right down the hall. 
Officer, would you that... mind just getting a coat? I'll grab your coat for you. Thank you, sir. Start making our way. Yep. Killed it. I did. My man, is this your phone, Mr. Marshall? Yes, sir. Thank you. All right. No. This is your phone, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, I didn't want it was on the floor. I didn't want you to lose it. We don't want you to lose your phone. No, you're my man. But should we call Tony just so I can... Ah, uh, I think he's on vacation right now. Because he's taking all his vacation because... Yeah, because he's, 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 he's retiring. He's so. not going to retire. No? He's not. Okay. Because I'm going to get him the money. All right. I'm going to get you guys uh, your contract. Go straight. Straight. No, straight. No, go I straight. Right there. Down here. I don't want to forget your thing. It's right there. You're running right into it. What? Right I, I got some food in here. I got to get... We, what, what, what kind oh, of food? It's a bag of... Right, grab if it's just a bag, that's fine. Grab that. It's a bag of food that I'll give to the homes. Okay. Go ahead, no, take I, I can't carry it for you, but you if okay, you want to take get the, the, the Make sure you're only taking things that are yours. You don't want people calling and complaining. Bro. Alright. At, at this office, it's amazing. This I woman, hear you. This Come on. Woman, all you do is call me. Yeah. Three weeks ago. I know. I know. And when we get downstairs, I'm going to talk to you about everything else you got going on, okay? So this is, sir? Yep. This is the gentleman that the police report gets made against. You can get his ID. Okay. I'll, I'll figure that out after we get downstairs. But right now, we, we just got to go, okay? So he chased me down here. Okay. Came in front of, started yelling over there. Okay. And then chased me into my office. Okay. I believe you. No. But then he told them that I harassed him. Okay. All right. Good. Where's where? Where do we go to the other? Room? We just go around straight. Just keep rolling. Yep. Just keep rolling straight down. I'm gonna put my mask on. Yep. Do that. My That's office it. is locked. Could you just make sure that office is locked? Which one is it? The one we left. This one right here. Just click the thing on the no, door. Locked, no, no. Yeah, he's no. Oh. Make sure my law office is locked over there. Just oh, click. that one. Yeah, yeah. No, I close it after we walk no, out. No, but it's not locked. It Clip the thing. We'll, we'll take care of that. No, we no, got, no. Uh, my stuff is in there. Just lock. The one that you were in, grabbing all 1911. Your stuff. Just 1911. go and okay. click the thing on the okay. door. I'll right? go take care of it for you. Set, Mr. Marshall. Thank you. Hang it on the edge. Hang it on the edge. Alright, we're, we're... Oh, sorry. Did the other guys pass their, their interview? Because it was three of you, wasn't it? Uh, no, not everyone did. <laughs> ah, she did, though. Steered her the right way. <laughs> this is what we do. I just go through life blessing people. People don't understand. Yep. You see all of these bags? Yep. You know where they're going. We're going to the police department. Okay. Because each of those bags costs 99 cents. Yeah. When they buy them from the police, then they're going to buy them for $100. Okay. And that's going to solve the gap. That'd be nice. There's 400 bags in there. That would be nice. You know what? There is a lady in the in Here, your take office. Your, you, want, you want your phone in your pocket? Can you slip it in there yeah. for you? There's there you a go. lady in your office. Okay. She knows how to get the money. Okay. But they wouldn't listen to it. As a matter of fact, that chief kicked me out of the police department when I was doing a strategy meeting. Yeah. And the lady says she just doesn't like the environment. Okay. You all right, man? Oh, yeah. The rookie is getting the workout. That's it. Yeah, they're getting the work in for him. No, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Oh, this way? Yeah. Yeah, which way are we going here? Which way is the elevator? You had a 50 50 seven, and you chose the wrong way. Well, look here. Uh, how are we getting out of here? We just keep going. It is a little weird. 
Now just make sure those people are in the conference room because I don't trust them. Okay. Right. You can go ahead. Okay. Come on. I'm just saying go ahead. I don't want to run into the people. Just go ahead. Okay. I got to watch him though. He's not going to hit you in the head. What's that? No, don't even just want them. Yeah. Come on, let's go. No, but come on, we gotta go. Come on, let's go. You're a grown man. Come on. Then let's go. He doesn't want to walk out unless they're in the conference room. Sir, come on, we've been extremely accommodating. It's time to go. I'm not walking out in front of people. They will be in the conference room. Sir, they have every right to be here. Please. Let's go. Come on. Let, let's just get, let's get this done. Here. Nobody's going to say anything to you. We're just leaving. I'm really trying to make this okay. easy for you as possible. Okay. Wait, wait. I left the power cord. It's too late. You got to go. You got the power cord. I watched you box it. Okay, then she got it. Here? Yeah, yep. you got it then. You're good. I watched you box it. All right, come on. You sure? So let's Absolutely. go. Grab your thing. Let's get the elevator loaded up. Nobody's going to say anything to you. Look at all this stuff. Bobby can't touch your stuff, okay? Oh. Okay, so you guys got it all. All right. No, we're not. Well, come on, let's just go. Let's get this all over to the elevator. No, no, you're, gonna, you're still going to get the okay. You got that? Take care of yourself, all right? All right, we'll take care of yourself. Yeah. I, my legs are just going to keep hitting the <laughs> I got it. I'm not going down the elevator with this gentleman. He's not going to get in the elevator with you. He's just calling. He's not getting in with you. We can only have three people in the elevator. Yep. Oh, you're going to fall. It's going to all fall. Put your hand on the top. That's all. I got it. I just don't want to screw, but screw it up on you. Right. Don't worry. He's not getting in the elevator. He's just getting it loaded up. Call the elevator. Hold the door open so you can load it up. Donna, can you do me a favor? No. I just need to know... <laughs> I need to know where to send the invoice for the TV commercial that was approved by your corporate vice. Send it here and I'll forward send it, it up to corporate. Can I pop on out, please? Can I address it to the CEO? Let's go. I'll throw that in there. Yeah. Hey, guys. Have a good day. You can only have to take it to the elevator. Take it to the lobby, Dave. Now, let me go over here. Well, you can't go in and buy yourself. Hey, I'm coming in with you, too, okay? We can only be three. Go on in. All right. Hey, come on. Let's go. Come on. Hop in. Let me go with her. You want to go with her? That's fine. I got her on the floor. Come All on. right, we'll see you downstairs. Yes, sir. Just call me if there's a yeah, one, yeah. Yeah, it's over here. Alright, go ahead. I'll pick that up in a second. We're not kneeling out any farther from there. Well, everything right here. We're not his personal service. He's, he's going he's to be responsible for the rest of us. What's that? Hi, yeah. Hi, yep. Some, she's new, so sometimes she gets bounced elsewhere.
if that'll happen. Wherever you're assigned sometimes, when you're new, if they need you in wherever, they're going to assign you there for the day. <clears throat> but yeah, she is considered down here. Um, we were extreme, and we'll talk about it afterwards. All right, sir. Where would you like to go? Let's sit right here. Okay. Oh, you want to sit over there? No, I, I was just wondering, is it okay if we leave your things here? Yeah, but you can't block well, the thing. We're having a conversation. It's a fire hazard. You've got to bring it over here. It's all right. We're good I'll for right now. All these eggs, and then there will be... So, Mr. Marshall. Mr. Marshall. Good to go. Well, we're going to talk about... Okay. Have a seat. Okay. This Everybody sit do. on there. So, we're going to do. I'm going to take your information Thank because you. you want... You wanted me to also write about your end of things, correct? Yeah, yeah. Pass the brown. Okay. Before we get to that, I'm just I'm just giving you a Would you would you mind just praying for us real quick? The police that you pray over all the time, every day, five forty five. Father God, we thank you for this day. But we thank you, God, for your protection, for your love, for your Sorry. guidance, and for your leadership. God, we ask, Father, that you would keep everyone protected and safe as we do our jobs and things that you have given to us. God, let us activate the power, the power that you have given to us, the power of the Holy Spirit to go forward and to be the best us that we can be. I pray for these men and women who not only serve but also protect our communities and our home, keep us safe. I pray for Mr. Marshall. God, keep them all safe. Let your will be done in our lives as we do what you have called us to do for such a time as this. We give you glory and honor. Let's get this stuff off the way, bro. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thanks, okay. Pastor. All right. So, okay. amen. Okay. That was great. All right. Hold, hold on, son. Here's the deal, Mr. Marshall. Okay, okay. Before, oh, hold on, let me explain well, something. I'll record audio so you don't have to take notes. Let's that's that's take fine. Phone. No, you guys do it. No. Well, we we, we, we record anyways. Cam. The body cam's been on the whole Here's time. the deal. That's what we have right, okay, I'm going to listen to everything you want to say on your end. I just have to get this out of the way right away. You can't go back there, up to that office. I understand. All right, not anywhere in there. Okay, I, this I is the come, last. No, I can come here. This is a common area. Yes, of course, but that 19th floor, you can't go there anymore. Understood. It's over. If you go there, that's instantly criminal. Okay, you get arrested for trespass. So I'm just giving you that one last. You know I know I mean? that's what you perceive. All right. But let me. Suggest okay. So now I just want to get that no, out of the way. So now you could tell me everything on your end, please. I just want to correct. You. Okay, go ahead. The correction is. Why don't you guys come up the chair? No, that's all right. We we got it. We're, we're going to be. Why is he the only one to get to that? I'd say he's the only today. I'm going to be writing these things down. Get her a chair. No, I'm fine. Sir, right. sir, come on, please. come on, let's go, because we got to go. Sir, I leave it, leave it, leave the, leave the chair, leave the chair, leave the chair. It's okay. We gotta go. We gotta go. So I need you to tell me quickly, like what you want to on your end. You know how embarrassing it is as an African American man. Two days in a row in this building, having cops surrounding him. And so I'm just asking you, everybody, sit down. We, but we can't though. Dude. We we have to go to. We, we already are getting called to go to the next one. Right, I'm just so that's, I just want to get your end of it before I leave, you know what I'm saying? You can't sit down in the chair, right? I could stand. Okay. We could stand. What's your date of birth, Mr. Marshall? That information they got yesterday. Okay. All right. I'll, so I'll find it in my system, you're telling me. So here's what I want you to do. Okay. Did, did you, some, he needs to go get the contract because that, no, listen to me, sir. The piece of paper that you had, did you see it in the office? Sir, I'm trying. I'm, you want my we side? Wanna, we want to talk about the harassment, and which is right. those things that you we already know. Civil, which I explained to you upstairs. Correct? I'm trying to tell him. I know, but as far no, 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 no. As no, far as all that goes, the, the that's over. Stuff, that that's you over. To talk to us about the harassment, people chasing you, people calling you. We that's want to hear about that. I'm trying to explain to you. So please tell me that, or else to, we have to go. You need that because okay. the harassment was that. The office manager, yep. John Cosgrove. John Cosgrove, okay. John Cosgrove, yesterday morning, I came into the office. I know, I know, but come on, we gotta. I came into the office yesterday morning. Yep. And I only stayed and didn't go back to New Rochelle because I didn't want any misconceptions. Okay. Mis any misunderstandings. Yep. 
because I have authority from their vice president of sales. Her name is Fatima Koenig. Okay. I have a letter, an email from her. I know they told me about that upstairs. Yeah. Right. And that email is in response to my question. Three questions. It's a long email. It first says, these people are screwing this up. I have millionaires coming here. I need to get this photo shoot done. Okay. And so, Ms. my questions were three. One, have my office set up by Monday for the shoot. Number, and I gave her the emails of the yep. three people that were coming. Tony Cobb. Radio personality, 93.5. Londell McMillan, who's probably the most famous African-American lawyer in the country. Okay. And Keith Klingskills. They were coming for a photo shoot. I have to pay these people $20,000, $10,000 a day, whether or not the shoot happens or not. Right. And so, when I came in, I actually spent all night putting together the set. We spent four weeks. I'm telling you all this because it needs to all be in the report. Okay. We spent four weeks doing research on all of these brands. Okay. That would invest. Mr. Marshall, oh, sir. Mr. Marshall, I'm not got, trying to cut you off. I gotta but we, finish it. It's you not been, you relevant to what we're doing. You've been cutting me out all day. I know. I'm saying, but can let you me please, finish. To get to the part we I'm need trying. you to tell me what criminally happened. And I'm trying to tell all right, you. All right. So I need you to. Okay. If you're not going to do that, then we're not, I, we're not going to stand here and talk about these other things. All right, so here's what I'm saying. When I, I, since I spent four weeks doing the contact, all day, the day before yesterday, in Burlington, bought $4,000 worth of stuff. Yep. We came, took an hour to unload. And there, $150 to get here, an hour, which is all on camera. You can get the video. Yep. We brought it in. Okay. They claim that I wasn't able, supposed to be in that office in right. 1911. Right. And that I should retrieve my stuff. Right. I came specifically to retrieve my stuff. Okay. And the office was locked. Okay. The office is locked and my stuff is only in there because Friday night, Donna left with us in the office. Okay. So I stayed working with Pastor Brown, who just paid for you, and we stayed and set up for the filming on Monday. Okay. I fall asleep, before I fall asleep, Friday night at four in the morning, I email the vice president of sales and I say, this thing has been a terrible misunderstanding, but let's deal with that later. I just need help fast. Okay. If you don't get involved, they're gonna mess this up. They're gonna embarrass me. They're gonna lose money for me. Right. And so I said, ask number one, set up my office for Monday. Yep. Ask number two, you need to write this down, this is the core. Ask number one, set up my office for Monday. Yep. I'm here Ask you. number two, empower Donna to get the sales contract done. Okay. Ask number three, okay. listen, I'm, listen, I'm listen, listen. Ask number three, I now need 15 offices in New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut, because I'm on the radio. So, the email that I got back from her says, in short, you can take a picture because the other lady did. It says, Sean, congratulations on your successful growth. What happened is not consistent with our policies. And in fact, here's what I'm going to do. Jeff, the vice president of sales, will get in contact with you. Okay. And first thing he's going to do is ensure that your office is set up for Monday and he will talk to you about the 15 other offices. And I will support you from afar and you will have a great day. Okay. Go to sleep, I get up, I go to the radio station. By the time I get to New Rochelle, I'm told in writing from Jeff, he says, I will take advantage of it. My area manager, Martha, yeah is responsible for all of New England. I will make sure that today there is a meeting invite done and first thing Monday morning, first thing Monday morning, we will be on the phone with you. Okay. Monday morning comes, I'm on the radio for 24 hours. I don't have email from him. 
I don't have a meeting set up. Okay. I send an email to him saying, did I miss the email? Did I miss the phone call? Because I have all of my three secretaries' yeah. information. Okay. So at that point, I say, I've got to catch this guy before I go to sleep because I've been up all night, but there's going to there's gonna be a problem if I don't. Right. So I, I email, I call Donna, and Donna, they got hemmed up in the office because she's playing both sides from the middle. All she wants to do is retire. They have her crying in the office. Jeff never calls me. Okay. I get a call from this woman, Martha. And I said, Martha, how are you? She said, I got to get you on this conference call. I said, ma'am, I've been up all night. I'm not getting on a conference call. I'll talk to you. And so she forces me onto a conference call, and these three people that I don't know begin to harass me on the phone. Okay. And then, all right, they tell me, your contract is good until February. Okay. So, end of February, your contract is good. The end of February or the beginning? The end of February. Right. I'll, make, I'll make note of that, okay? okay? And then, okay, so now, I go to sleep, I then follow up with Fatima and tell her what happened. The people have insulted me. And here's what's going to happen. I still have to get the photo shoot done. Thank you for making this work. So, at that point, so that now is last Monday. Okay. I then are in meeting. Mr. Marshall, I'm we, trying to get to today. So I, I know you, you got to get to it now or else we're going to go. Trying, we, we can't sir. continue. But I'm trying. There, there it is. We, we, we really it, have to go. I don't know what to tell you. You got like one more minute, all right? All right. Please. Everything so, that you've talked about thus far has not reached but Yes, it does. Because, so, but what so, I'm so, saying is, what it does is proves to you that that document, which was never served, which you saw was not right. there, is not right. And so there is no reason why I can be prohibited from an office. I have a contract. Okay. All right. So that's point number one. So you get that. Yeah. So now we buy all this material. We get all the brands. We got phone calls to Biden's people. Miss, Mr. Oh, Marshall. Listen to me, sir. I, I told you, like you got I'm like another minute or two. It. And so now I come here. We set up everything and we stage the common area because the office that they claim I should not be in is locked. I cannot put anything there for the television shoot, which Fatima has already agreed now, to do. Is this 9-11 or is it, or 1911 or is this the other office? 1911. Which is not on the contract for you, correct? 1911 is the office that Fatima said would be set up. 1911 and 1922. If I were to look at the contract, what would be on the contract? It says 1905. You know I'm hard. Right, on the contract it says 1978. The contract that they were trying to get me to sign for $16,000 says 1911, 1922. And that... They were trying to get you to sign, but you haven't signed it yet. I, so that's not the contract. I have not signed. Right. We're running in circles. No, you're, you're, Do you know what I'm saying? But I'm, just, we're but running in circles over I know you're getting, water. Okay, Roger. Uh, we can't... They're Here's the problem. We gotta go, man. We gotta go. Finish telling you the story. Really quick, really quick. It's gotta be really quick. Come on. Okay, so now, this is the room where the common area, common area is set up with four thousand dollars worth of stuff. Right. Meticulous. Right. I could see that. Yeah. When I get, and they took it all and put it. No, in no, no. It didn't happen. So I'm still a customer. I, I stay. Uh, wake up in the office, took an hour nap, and I said, John, I just would like to talk to you. He starts yelling at me, so that's the first yeah. harassment. John Cosgrove, the manager, starts yelling at me, and I said, sir, we don't have a problem. Let's not get in the middle of this. This is your right. vice president. So now, I then say to John, later on, my lawyer has said, if anybody needs to contact me, it's not you, John, or Donna, that they should email okay. rosieangel2021 at gmail.com. And she will decide which okay. of my attorneys the thing to go to. Okay. That's who you need to speak to about this, but all right? This Sir, we have We're to go. Missing We're not missing listen, the point. We have to go. Listen, You're not getting to I'm the trying point. to get to the point. So now I say to John, I, I say to John, I'm leaving. I got to go to New York. I say, wait, wait, Maria's coming. I said, I didn't know. So I leisurely walk to my office from the boardroom, yep. walk around. 1978, I get my coat, and I get 
the person who works for me, Pastor, it's an important name, Pastor uh, Darlene Thompson. Okay. She gets her coat and she's walking me downstairs. We get to the elevator and John starts saying, Sean, Sean! Elevator closed. I don't know what's going on. We then leisurely walk in. We walk all the way over here. We're walking. We get all the way over here. Yep. Well, we're going we're gonna to leave from this exit, okay? Sir, Bobby, at what point did right, John come on, start we got it. It's time to go. Okay, we have to go. I, I know. We talked to them. We have to go. We've, we've, we've accommodated you. We have listened to you. Sir, sir, are you going to... We're almost done. None of this is criminal. Okay? What? If somebody's chasing you down the hall... John! That's not, that's not what... You, you're not getting to that point. That's you have you to... Not letting me get to the point. You have to get to it. You're, you're rambling about other things. Things. There's other, this, this is, there's a lot of, a lot of crazy things going on right now. We can't stand here anymore. And so what I'm trying to tell you, we start walking. So who chased you? Because that's, that's John what I'm going to mention. Okay. Okay. I'm going to mention that. Okay. Starts, no, but you got, if somebody what? take a note. I got, I wrote his name down already in here. So he starts chasing me. Okay. We get to here. I heard the door. John, John, John. The 464 lady comes back. Yeah. Brings my coat inside. Okay. Because she's frustrated and scared. Right. So that's the first harassment. Okay. All right. The second harassment. Right. We got to go really quick. What okay. is it? The second harassment. Sean, whatever his name is. Yep. Let's get out of here. Come on. Let's let's go. Like let's go. We got to We got to go. We got to go, man. Let's go. Yes. And we, the second one. We don't have time for this. The second one is today. Mr. Sean okay. comes into the manager's office. You can get Rob. Rob tried to broker a meeting. Yeah. Okay. He tried to Hello. broker a meeting. I'll talk to you. 7 30. I'm a little tied up, so it's going to be tomorrow. <laughs> What's going on, brother? How are you? So, come on. We, we got to go. We don't have any more time for this. You know, I'm not trying to be rude. But you don't let, let me listen. So, John, Rob, what's his name? What's the boss's name? John, Rob? Rob. He tries to broker a meeting. We go to his office. I'm sitting down. He invites Martha to come down. Okay. That was first Donna. And what was the harassment? Because the You're guy comes. What's the yeah, I'm sitting down. The guy comes in. All rough and We got it. We got to go to D9. I said, sir, I don't feel comfortable. He didn't we have leave. to go, sir. Sir, there's something going on in okay. another district. Right, we have so to go. I'll give. If you want, I'll write the report. So the first harassment was. Uh, I know so the chase. How about, how about Mr. The second, let me finish. Let me finish. I'm a little upset. We have to go. The second, There's something serious going on. Second, the fast. second harassment. We've been here for an hour. I know. As far as I've been here, that's we, not including how long they've been, been here. We've been here almost an hour now. We have to go. Close with police in two days. So the second harassment is the guy um, Sean harassing me in the office. Yeah. Okay. Now, what's the third one? What's the third one? And the third one was that guy Josiah. You said you're going to get his name and his license. And you have to get his name and his license. No, I, oh. I, I'm going to call. I have no, Maria's no. information. Somebody I'm going to call. Here is going right. to get the man's okay. name. We're leaving. License. We're so leaving. So what did he do that was harassment? Okay. Straight to the point. What did he do that was harassment? He yelled at me and chased me into my office, and I said, sir, leave me alone. Okay. All right. We'll find out about that. He said, Sean, and he starts yelling, Sean, okay. you don't know, Sean. And I said, sir, I don't feel comfortable. Okay. I'll figure that out. I'm no, gonna call Maria. I'll get on. We'll get that white man's license, or we have a problem. Excuse me. That guy will get embarrassed like I did. Some one of you three will do it. Mr. And if you don't know, no, I'm fine. Mr. One of you will get that man's license. I will not be embarrassed by the police again. He, his, he will be embarrassed. No, I'm Stop pleading. yelling, I'm, or you're gonna get arrested. Well, sir, if you arrest we have me, been arrest here. me. Arrest we have me. been if here you want over to an hour. Arrest me. Accommodate. Arrest me. You want to arrest you me? You have arrest to leave. Me. You know what? I think we're going to go. You're no. Going no. 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 We're there is a. Get, we're not going to go. There, no, you're no, screaming no. at me. Because I'm sitting down, and now the three of you are around me. I'm speaking to you, and I'm. I'm saying to you. I'm saying this. You are screaming, and I have to raise my voice to talk over you. No, no, no. We are not going to keep doing this. We just got all of your belongings. No, this gentleman. Grab your stuff and go, or you're getting arrested. And that is it. You're if out of this building. Let's go. If you are not leaving, then we will be forced to take criminal action on you. We don't want to do that. So let's, go. let's now. finish this tonight. No. This gentleman's going to write Let a report. Nope. The, this no. This gentleman's going to write a report. The man will have his license taken for the report. We will do that, but right now you need to go. Now. What?
Brother, what, what are you Now. Where am I going? You're blocking my way. Where do you, Let's where go. Would you like to go? Get your stuff you and go. Let's go. Let's go. Now. Start moving on because we can't keep doing this. Now. Come on. Let's go. We We've been here for over an hour. You have to leave the entire building. Let's go. No, I don't. Yes, you do. I do not. You're causing a disturbance in here. I look over at security. Security saying you now have to leave the building. Let's go. Now. I'm getting my stuff. And I'm, go. I'm suggesting. Do I got to count to the three like you're a kid? Let's go. Sir, count to your kid. You know, I'm not just kid. I'm, I could be your father. You don't you're, treat you like a child, sir. Well, I tell you what. If you do not, if you do not follow protocol, the police report needs to be taken, and the man's license will be taken. I told you if we you are taking care of that. If you do not want my attorney to sue the city, you will follow the protocol and get the Let's man's go. license Sir, who harassed me. Okay. No, you will get his license. You will not ever get my license when I'm the problem and not get the white man's license. You will get Grab his license. Grab your stuff. Sir. Raise your voice one more time. I am putting you in handcuffs. That is your last warning. Well, please put me in handcuffs. Let's go. Please put me in handcuffs. Let's go. No, please put me in handcuffs. That's please. a warning. Let's go. No, it's war I'm, you, brother, you ain't warning me. Let's go. Uh, we're gonna go, and I'm gonna leave as soon as you get the man's life. We're, we're not going back up there. We're not doing that. That's fine. No, 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 no. no Which no, exit are you no, going? No, no, no. Through? They, they tried That's to get enough. my license yesterday. Turn Hold up, man. What? Turn around. Hold up. Get off me. Turn around. Officer, get off me. Get off me. Stop. Get off me. Turn. No. Get off. 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 Why are you hitting me? What the fuck? Are you hitting me? What are you hitting me for? What are you hitting me for? Stop. 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 All get off. Stop. Sean, you come should on. all get off. We just Sean. want you to roll please over. Let me You're go. resisting arrest. Please. Please yeah, let me go. Where you, what do you need? Ouch. Stop. 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 Let me go. Let me go, go. Let me go home. Your hands and I will put you, we will put you in the handcuffs and this all stops. Stop. All I'm saying is we don't need Sean. to be doing this. Okay. Okay. Let Give me us go. your hand. No. Let me go. No. Out! Stop! Out! 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 Stop! Come on! You're gonna get sprayed. Stop! Oh, come on! Ouch! I can't breathe. Come on! Come on! Stop! Come on. I can't breathe. Stop! Okay, I can't breathe, brother. Stop! Okay, breathe. Okay. Let's go. All you had to do, stand him up. Get up. Get up! One, can, can two, you, wait, wait, wait. I'm going to get up. Just let me leave me alone. Shot. One, let me get up. Oh, I can get up by myself. Stand up. They're trying to help you up. Please just stand up. Okay? Let me get up, please. I need something for my eyes. Secure everybody's stuff. Cameras came off and everything. Somebody I'm going to get an ambulance ah. here for you. Ah. Give me some water. Get that water on me, please. Put the water on my eyes. Yeah. Yeah. 
Put an order on the line. Please. Start a signal uh, line. Lean back. I need to lean back. Okay. Start a water mine. You need to open your eyes. Open your eyes a little bit. Open. Force them. Force them open. Okay. Relax. 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 Take a breath. You're okay. Don't hurry, but you're okay. 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 You're fine. You're fine. One more. Okay. In. Roger, I'll uh, 35 them once I get back outside my phone. I'm good. Please. Please. What's my number? Here's your glass. Ah, I don't know. Please take my, put the water in my eyes. The ambulance is coming for you. There's more water. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Lean back. Lean back. Lean back. Lean back. Lean back. Lean back. Yep, yep. Okay. 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 Relax. 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 Can you take the handcuffs okay. off my hands so I can wipe my face, please? We we're in the lobby. We can't do that because the whole reason that we're in this predicament is because you didn't listen to our instructions. No, we're not in that. Okay. Case. So the answer. What is your answer, issue, ma'am? No, okay. So just. You can call a family member for me if you want. That's what I was asking. He asked me. Who said you could? Give me my phone. Give me. Okay. If he says it's okay, you can take his phone. Yeah. At least so one of his family members are aware of it. No. If he says it's okay. That's all you got to do. Is this your watch? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Can I get my phone? It's all going to go with you. Jalisha, yes. give me my phone. Give me more water in my eyes, please. Okay. Sit down. When AMR gets here, they'll have a saline saline wash and they'll wash it, okay? Bye -bye. So it's just temporary relief. It's not helping okay. you any, okay? More Put more water. You're okay. The Put ambulance is coming. Put more water. They have a certain right, solution relax. that's going to okay, help relax. them. Okay. Deep breath. Deep breath. There you go. Yeah. Okay. Give me my phone. Yeah. No. Okay, Give me my phone. Under face. One nine. Give me my phone. One nine. Okay, I'm just going to look at my phone. No, 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 no. Don't let him just sit there with just his phone. Look at my phone. Right, it's unlocked. Just not look at my phone. It's unlocked. I'll call her. Yeah. Let her you just call. Control. Let, you can't. let her call for you. Okay. okay. I'm calling her right now. Just take some deep breaths. I want to sit in a chair, please. I know. Once AMR gets here, they're going to check you out. They're probably going to put you on a stretcher just to check you out, okay? Sweetie, why did that happen? Because we asked you to leave and you were not leaving. I was walking that way. Sweetie, you're not that stupid. I was walking. Sir, I'm genuinely answering your question. When people don't obey our I was walking there. I understand. I just that was just leave it alone. Just all leave it alone. That's all. No. We cannot do that anymore. We, we're past that point, Mr. Marshall, unfortunately. No. Right. But you were raising your voice and screaming at no. us and telling us that you even told us you wanted to be arrested and at one point. Let's so. get clear. If you threatened me to be arrested, I've been arrested. Then we am, I, am I under arrest? Yes. Currently. Am I under arrest? Currently. Yes, you are. Yeah. Okay, so you can be on the rest day? No. No. Not right now. Okay. Not in this moment. We have no reason not to. What's your last name, Pete? Your date of birth? August 27th. Yep. 1958. Your phone number? 203. I hate them because you punched me in the face. 449. 7547. Okay. Thank you. Kicked me long before I punched you. Thank you. And you got me on the ground, and when you came at me, I kicked him in the face. Okay. You guys are so stupid. How did you do this? You know better. Mr. Reba, or not Mr. Reba, Mr. Marshall. He's Mr. Reba. You resisted arrest, you kicked a police officer. Everything else that happened after that? No, you punched me in the face and I kicked you dead in your okay. face. That's your you side of it. You punch me yep. again, I'll kick you dead in the face again. Okay. That's fine. It's not what happened, but okay. Seven, three. <clears throat> I don't know where the hell I went. What's that? No, my little back anchor, my, okay. my thing. It's not the major, it's all right. I was walking to my stuff. You started hitting me. I was to What's up, man? Did you deal with this guy yesterday? No. Did you take the call with him yesterday? Or is that somebody else? 
I have the people in my pocket. One. <laughs> no. No? Okay. Roger, we're not okay. getting an answer on the call back. You didn't see it. Hey, Bobby, can I get some ice for my face, please? The ambulance is going to help you out with that. Because yeah, obviously, you as the head of security, she's going to create a disturbance inside the lobby. You've got to go. Right. Right, because he has to leave the entire building. Exactly. Right. No, he hit me in the face. He hit me in the face. And a stupid idiot, it's all on camera. You dumb dumb. Yeah. <laughs> idiot. Did anybody else get All you had to do was go get the man's license, which you still have to do by protocol. Sir, we told you we All could. you have to do, you no, you did not. You said you were going. I Stop lying. Did not need Sweetheart, to be here for like, the rest of the investigation that we had his information and you don't, we would like you to you leave. No, you don't the understand. Building. And I was going to get my stuff. You can humiliate a black man Sir, by getting you were his license. Screaming and, at us because saying that you, refused you need to, to do, do your job. Do your job. Because he was a white man and you wanted to see his license. That's specifically no, what you said. That's not what I said. It I is. said if you can force to get my license, embarrass you know me. Just don't even let him sit there. <laughs> yeah. Very good. Hey, call my phone and call Derek Sells from the Cochran firm or Trent McCain. No, we're not, we're not going to keep doing this. It's my phone. You're you detained. We're not going to keep doing that. You want You'll have code? an opportunity to make whatever phone call you want Would after you like the process. Code? 19. <laughs> and the phone will go with 19, you. Uh, 1933.89. You guys think you can do anything to people? All you had to do is let me go get my stuff. And now you're all fired. Did your boss say they were coming? That's so sad. Did anybody say they were coming? Supervisor? Okay, good. Call, call uh, Chief Reyes. Nobody's calling Chief Reyes. First call Derek Sales. Jaleesha. Call Trent McCain. We cannot, we cannot make calls to everybody. So after AMR, check some out before we put them in the wagon. Call Trent McCain, my cousin. Trent McCain, call her. Can I have some more water, please? The ambulance is almost here. Yeah, I have some more water, please. It's guarding my eyes and my face. One, one. Is the one coming, ma'am? Right, just let them know we're in the lobby. We're not going to move him until after they uh, treat him. Jalisha, call the, call the number. She cannot, you're a private citizen. Go behind the desk, do your job. Do your job. Go behind the citizen. She cannot harass you. Go ahead, sir. No problem. Thank you. Have some more water, please. The ambulance is going to treat you. You're here for an hour. We're over here for over an hour with him, accommodating him, getting all this stuff. Because he was kicked out of that building upstairs, you know, one of the offices. And then he starts causing a disturbance down here. Screaming, yelling. And then we go outside, that's enough. We go to handcuff and fights. Kicks me. So, assault and a PO as well. <laughs> What's that? I was walking to get my stuff. Jaleesha, don't say anything. One seven one. 
I think they're here. Yeah, just tell. It's just the OC spread. Revis, I know you too. That's the sad part. You know me, don't you? Revis, you know me. Revis, can I have some more water? It's, it's burning. The ambulance is here. Do you walk in and know. That's all I want. Some They're going to bring you in something, okay? Some, I want some water to drink and some water for my eyes. He was given a million opportunities. Jalisha, go behind the desk and do what you want to do. You are a private citizen. They have no right to harass you. I'm looking at them harassing you. Call my cousin, attorney Trent McCain, right now, please. Text Derek Sells. Did and tell them that anymore? the police yeah, have just I, don't know. I just saw them walk over here. I don't know what they're doing. 157 Church Street immediately. You see Derek in the, in the phone, Jalisha? Yes. Please text him. The GPS doesn't come to the exact building. Yeah, they won't you see call Derek for the wagon. Sells, yes. Please text him. <laughs> See, they're walking in now. They're going to give you a certain solution that's going to help you out. Hello. He was uh, OC sprayed. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He was OC sprayed, so we just wanted you guys to give him a proper Sir, wash on before is, he goes. Why, why does somebody get OC sprayed? We're not here to discuss that right now. They're here to help you. Can you get my eyes are really burning? So I have a flush with sterile water. Okay, what am I doing? You're just going to tilt your head back when I tell you to. I'm going to flush your eyes out, all right? Thank you. It's going to be a, a little messy, though. Just a spray of water. Call and call, uh, Jaleesha, call uh, Austin. Fire Chief Alston, John Alston, A-L-S-T-O-N. Take a picture, text it to him. Take a picture, text it to Derek Sales. Take a picture, text it to Trent McCain. Thank you for your service. All right, we tilt your head back. I'll, uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be assault and a police officer interfering. The reason why I call him is because this was like a show. I'm rolling around with this guy. Because yeah, you've been on this call for a while. Yeah, we were more than accommodating. That's all the stuff over there. We're not taking it, obviously, because that's insane. We can't log that all in. But he got banned from the building the other day, up on the wall from the 19th floor. Can you know, It's all civil stuff. It was, it was a contract breach, so he was allowed to have one, one office, and he started taking stuff from the other office. And he was like, listen, this is a breach of our policy. You can't be taking all this office space. They banned That's not yours. So you need to what leave, you need to get out. Right. And so the past That's two days, Fire Chief Austin wants to know what the charges are. Charge Who is that? Fire Chief Austin. No, no, don't, we're not. That's not the case. We're not going to speak to him over the phone right now. Call, call Ronnell Higgins. She's Ronnell Higgins. This is what, so, yeah, so he's, he had a service for you. He violated it for whatever reason. He was disturbing the rest of the offices. He was told in writing on Wednesday he can't be here. Still shows up. We're extremely nice to him. Okay, told listen, technically trespassing. Nice. Did you guys ever get him to get all this stuff out? Yeah, that's all this stuff. So we spent an hour with him. I saw you guys been on this call. Yeah, for we while. took we took our time. We let him grab all his things. He comes down here and he wants to. He keeps rambling about whatever. We warned him several times. He's got to go. Like it's time to go. He starts getting. Raising his voice in here, we're looking over at the head of security for the entire building. He's like, "We gotta go." So it's trespassing not only up on the 19th floor, but trespassing this entire building. Tell him okay. he's getting arrested. He starts to fight. We start rolling around the ground with him. He kicks me. Um, Julie, do you text the picture? And then, yeah, he got. Well, I'll tell you the rest. Of it. 
Over an hour of accommodating. Okay. Yep. So tell me again. Um, so, officer, am I under arrest? So, yes. What are the charges? I, what are the charges? You don't have to if there are charges, I am under arrest. If there are no so, charges, I am free to go. Sir, I just told you you're under arrest. Well, let what you are the charges? charges? Yeah, he gets. I'm, he was told on Wednesday he no longer could be on me in that office upstairs. Okay. Got banned. So it's like if you go to Starbucks. What are the charges? My hands are here. Sir, your shoe. Would you like to put your shoe back on, Mr. Marshall? Yep. The officer is bringing your shoe over. So okay. What, what are the charges? You're being, you're being arrested for assault on a police officer, interfering with an officer, trespassing, and disorderly conduct. Sir. Okay. Who hit who You guys first? are all set? All set. One, one. Thank you. Uh, start to 29, please. Don't let them. Don't let them walk away. I'm trying to sit down so I can put my shoes on. So I need to sit down. I, I have handcuffs. Okay. Right. I'm not sitting on the floor. Don't let him. Bring him over can here. Can I put my? Okay, let's. let's we'll figure out the shoe down. over here. Come on. Put your shoe on. Hands off of me. Put your shoe on. I'm just. Can I put my shoe on, please? I brought it to you. There you go. Good. That's all. Good yeah. to go. Now I need to, I need to get my hat and my coat. They're over there. Can I get my She's going to grab your coat and your hat. She's going to get it. Come on, let's go. over here. Just stop touching me. Mr. Marshall. I'm getting my hat. It's right there. Okay. You want your phone back. Another pickup at 157. Get off of me. Stop touching me already. Let's go. I'm going to get my Come stuff. Is right. Let's go. You're under arrest. You're not okay. in control here. What, You're not what, in control anymore. Will you please let me go get my... here for about two hours with you. That is it. That is it. Sir, may I get my hat? We're going to get it. We're going to get it out for you. You're not going to hear and dictate what we're going to do or what we're not going to do. Here's what I'm going to suggest, sir. All right. What is your name My name is badge? Sergeant Kusi So it's 471. Excuse okay? me, sir. Is there, a reason, why, is there a reason why you're yelling at me, officer? Because you're trying to tell my cops what to do and what not to do. Okay? They actually work for me. You're under arrest. What am I under arrest for? We already told you. No. We're not going to go repeat it again. Okay? Where's his hat? Right here? Okay. I need my Let's mask. Go. Sir, I need to get my mask. We're in COVID. It's on the ground. I don't believe Let me you get, want to put that I mask. Come on. Let's go. It's been on the floor. Outside. We're not going to give you a mask that's on the floor. I need to get my... Those are my belongings. Let's We're going to get it for you. I told you that. Can I get a hat? Let's go. My hat is right there. It's cold. Do any of these doors work? Sir, can I get a hat? Can I get a hat, sir? Let's go. I need our car. I got to get my medicine. I got to go to the hospital to get my medicine. Sir, can I get to the hospital to get my medicine? I want my medicine. Sir, you need to get my medicine. Okay. Our car, our car. Can you just stop by my house and get my medicine? We'll sir? figure that out. Okay. He's got to search you before we put you in the car. So spread your feet. Spread your feet. Thank you. you you won't fall. Nope. Yeah. Here, we got a clean mask for you. He's going to put on. I just grabbed a clean one for you, sir. Let me just get in the, in the, in the back. The car is cold. Yeah, absolutely. He's got to search you. We'll put you in the car. Search you in the search you in there. It's freezing, bro. Turn towards me. Sir, Hold on. Gotta, Stay can still. Can you just search me inside? It's freezing. Just hold on to that. Man. See if there's an ID, an ID in there. I can give you my, you don't have sir, stand still. I'll give you my uh, license. You don't need my license. I'll give you all the ID you need. Else? No. Get his money. That's dropping. You can have it. No, that's get your my, property. That's my, my, my Vaseline right there. We're going to get no, your Vaseline. I got, I got, I got. You see it right there? Yes, the yes, sir. Can I get in the car, please? I'm freezing. You good with him? Yeah. Get right, my, my Vaseline right there. Put that back in his pocket. I have my license back. Put your Vaseline's going in there. Can, can Grab put, that money. Yeah, can you put my hat on, please? Sir? Get in there first. It's nice and warm in there. I can get it. Let me turn it right. Can you put my hat on, please? See it? Yeah, that's his. Yeah, that broke there in the. Just use your flashlight. Make sure nothing else drops. I got a penny in that lifesaver. 
um, you got the wagon or you want to do the transport or what? We could transport. Get I called for it. Yeah. Whatever's easier for you. Make it, make it um, easier for the situation. No, we could. I got to fill the slip. Oh, I haven't That's even gotten process. that far. Yeah. Okay. Um, thank you. That's him. Just, there's no other money on the ground? I think there was like a penny or besides that penny that fell, nothing. Right. You got any wagon slips in your bag? I don't. You don't? Then yeah, you got one? Yeah. All right, so look, we're going to run him first, right? Yep, 45 seconds. Yep. Do we have his phone? Yeah, it's right there. Now, uh, did you, who sprayed him? I did. Okay. All right. Oh, and, so I'll uh, do you, all that. Give me the quick rundown again. Yeah, so how, how we physical. come here. Oh, how it got fisky. Yeah, because you know yeah, how. Because I already got the little bit so of So we come back downstairs with all this stuff. And, you know, he goes, I want to be heard. We spend probably a good 20 minutes listening to him about his end. Start telling him, listen, we have to go. We yep. can't be here all night. It's a busy night. Um, get to the point you know, what's criminal, what's not. Um, <clears throat> then he gets upset because one of the, like, a party that's supposedly involved, that I told him about 10 times, I'll call the original complainant back once we're done here, and I'll get that guy's information. But right now, you need to go. He, he gets upset that we're not taking this guy's name or whatever. So... That's when he starts yelling, screaming. I'm looking at the head of security. He's like, he's got to go. He's causing disturbance in the lobby. Sure, sure, you know? sure. Um, so, <clears throat> tell him. Let me call you back. So, I go to grab him, put him in handcuffs after he's worn a bunch of times. Um, and then he just starts fighting. Not just, like, tries running. He's pushing. He tried first, running? Tried running. Um, tries running. I'm, I'm going to go back and watch this before. No, absolutely, absolutely. Um, but tries running. Because things happen so fast. Sometimes yes, and then when we get on the happen. ground, he's straight up. Okay. Well, not the face. He's like I, I my agree. legs. Okay. And then that's when I get back. He's not like a donkey kick. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah that's why I, I'm going to charge assault and PO. Okay. Um, and uh, eventually, like, we can't. He's refusing to get, keep his hands. We and cough. Then, and then you spray him. And then eventually I spray him, and probably, like, less than a minute after that, he starts to give up. And sure. He gets the cuff. He just, he just wants to put on a show. That's all he's doing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 100%. All right. You know, because they are all, all fucking 10 of them are in there, not one person. Else. There's just the three of us and him. Yeah. And, uh, I mean, I get it, but the one good thing is the head of security, I walked up to him, I said, did you see him kick you? He goes, yeah, you, he kicked you long before you hit him or anything like that. So he's, okay. on, he's on tape okay. saying that. Yep. Because the other, okay. the other ones are. You're in custody because you're. Watch. Okay. I just want you to know I'm Hello. on your phone and I'm putting it on the dashboard so it doesn't okay. fall anywhere. Okay. Hi, Pastor Brown. Yes. Yes. About an hour ago. Right. Yes. <laughs> Unfortunately, it it took a different turn. And... All right. I'm going to fill out the slip. David, sit in the car with me. So we'll fill this up. No, you're good. Just just stand by outside right now. One one IS number six. They they will erase that information. Take all my stuff. No, you're not going to take the ID. You're not. That's my property. Forty five no. check, please. It's going to be on a black male. Last name is Marshall. Common spelling. First name is Sean. Sierra Hotel Alpha no, Whiskey November. Date of birth zero eight one six. You do not have Six, permission eight. to take my license. Because that is not my address. You do not have to take my... They took my license out of my... Come here. You have to take the license with you because that's my property. It belongs in my wallet. Take the phone. Give me the phone. What's the code? This is it. Listen. I need you to take the phone right now. Put the code in. I am about to, I'm no, come here. I'll put it in my phone. Go ahead. Give me a pen and She's pen. taking all the stuff. If he says so, obviously the ID's got to stay with us. Yeah, right. Sorry, I, down the code for my phone. I can hear you, sir. I'm sorry. I just need a pen and paper to write down the code. Oh, see, I don't have the code. I need a piece of paper. I don't have one. One second. 
Give it your phone. Give me 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 your phone. And they have my coat for you're gonna get my coat for you're gonna, you're gonna get No, I need a coat. Mr. Marshall. Mr. Marshall, where what's your address? I live at her address, 84 Hudson Street. 84 Hudson Street. I need my license back. Okay, 84 Hudson, thank you. Can you get my license from the office and go around the corner and get the license? No, you no. Have the license? Sir, I relax with the license. It's got to go. No, with that's you. my purse. It's going with you. No, it's no I, she, the license is going with her. It's got to stay with you. No, it yes, doesn't. It does, I'm sir. giving my license and my wallet. Only thing I want is my coat. I don't want to give him the kind of table, but he'll tell you. Tell me. Give me, give me the pen. Yes, he can. Yes, give me the pants. Sir, I don't need to sir, tell me the code. Then walk away. Okay, then we're set. We're then walk set. away. Man, we're all set. The, I'm not going to sit here and play My chapter games. was founded okay. in that year. I'm trying to help you, man. One nine. Hey, it's one nine this, this. G, it's one nine this, this. This, this. This, this. Don't. And then this. Mr. Marshall, how tall are you? I'm, I'm talking to her. What, give me one second. Okay. Let me show me the number that you wrote down and I'll tell you. Turn it around. Okay, that's signal 32, 110 has been listed. Signal 32, 110 has been listed. That's not it. It's, it's, the, it's the bottom. Could some, does anybody know trespass first off the top of their head? I do not. Do you want me to look it up? Nah, I'll pull it up real here quick. Know the code. I got the address. How tall are you? Ask trespass. him how tall he is. I'm going to tell you it's not trespassing. There's no trespassing. Don't put it in there. You're going to be in trouble. I'm a lawyer. Okay. All right. Now his jacket can hit the window. I need my jacket because it's cold. And I need it. And I need my... I need, you got my, get my license for this gentleman, cause that's my wife. How tall are you? How tall are you? Do you have the correct address, sir? 84 Hudson, right ma'am? Yes. Can you ask him how tall he is and how much he weighs? How much? How much do I weigh? Yes. Two, uh, 210. 210? Thank you. How much, how tall are you? Ask him for my license, please. G! G! Get my license. How tall are you, Mr. Marshall? 511. Thank you. All right. I'm hopping out. I'm getting out, ma'am. I just don't want to. I don't want to hit you. Thank you. Yeah. Time to go. His license has to go with him, ma'am. That's part of the identifying process. He has bipolar disorder. That's that. Thank you so much for telling us. So let's keep it quiet, because otherwise he'll freak out. Please take him to the hospital. As of right now, we don't have a reason to send. You know what I mean? Yes, it's right here. Yeah. If there was a reason to send him to the hospital, I would. As of right now, there's not. We had him checked out by the ambulance. Okay. All right. I appreciate you telling me that he's bipolar because that actually makes a lot of sense to everything that we dealt with. Um, you know, like I said, we've been here. And don't, please don't call that. That's his ex-wife's address. Use the 84 Hudson Street. Yeah, that's what I put on here. I put that right on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. Yep, absolutely. There you go, Jay. This way, right here. Uh, I'm, I'm, you want me to put that in the truck? I'm not doing that. You want me to put that in the truck while you're swapping out? Make sure you guys are full. Yeah, you know, yeah. yeah. Let's leave those on there. Yeah, leave those on. We'll come pick them up. Just go ahead, load them up. We're going to pick up the cops after. Can, I can get in the car by myself. Okay. Just let, brother, let me go. I can get, I'm a grown man. Two hours of. Sure. Sir. Thank you. Come on. This is Sean Marshall, founder of Restoration Power Ministries, oh. and they're harassing me. Let's go. It's time to go. Get him up in the wagon. All the noobs say yo. Watch your head. All Let's the go. Kappas. Watch your head. Watch, 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 your head. Watch, watch your head. Sit him on the back. All the brothers of Cap Alpha Psi, stand up.
brother, I can get in the car. Just let me then stand I, up. Let me scoot in. Let me scoot in. Just let me scoot in. Let me scoot in. I can't scoot you in the way. Or else you gotta go in the car. Thank you. All the noobs. All the you gotta sit up on the bench. Hold up for your safety. Right, you wanna tell the, him, ma'am. You're on the bench. Hold on, hold on. He's gotta you gotta stand up. Sir, sir, you can, we can't commute. We can't go on there without that guy on the bench. There you go. There we go. Hold on to the straps. Thank you, ma'am. Hey, sir. Watch your step. Can I put my coat on? Yeah, your coat's going with you. Don't worry, brother. Is that coat 44? Make sure there's nothing in that coat. Hey, does she have my license? That coat's. Check you check the coat, right? Make sure you always do that. Make sure there's nothing on. Hey, G, call Frank Dixon. Call Frank Dixon. All right, just shut that. You can get the coat out. The coat can go there. Yep. It's all set. Yeah. Nothing's in it. Hey, lock that door. How does it lock, Jay? Yeah. Oh, that's a new one. Just push it down, right? Right here. Yeah. Nice. Look at that. Look at that. Locks that work, doors that open. No, no, wait, wait. But, but the pastor just looked at me and she said, he's bipolar. Yeah, she told yeah. me that. So, yeah. so that makes, his emotions were like this the whole well, time. Up and down, up whole and down. Time. Now it all makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I could have told him that. Yeah.